In this episode of King's Quest 3 to Ares Human Walkthrough, I show you how my hero Widian can cross the second ordeal of the Colored Stones. This and much more. Stay tuned. VideoGamersOasis.com Play Subscribe This episode of Video Gamers Oasis Play Theater is brought to you by Feature Points Get free gift cards Games And much more Try free apps Get rewards Go to your iOS or Android browsers And type HTTP colon forward slash forward slash f e a t u dot r e forward slash v g o use the app start reaping the rewards welcome back to king's quest 3 to air is human walkthrough i'm your host jeremy the Miki. uh becoming very advanced we're making very far in this game uh so far we're we've met the par pirates with our alexander slash uh, Gideon and we are on our way to Treasure Island we have completed one of the ordeals now we're going to the second ordeal so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a video for the second ordeal take a break and then we'll continue with the third ordeal that's how I'm going to do this so let's uh, restore our game continue on to glowing swamp stones this is where I left left off now Listen very carefully. I'm following following the instructions from this walkthrough that I had in my uh, cell phone uh, that I saved. So we're in the treasure island of Saran. With a shovel and a piece of paper in hand, go to the left. Just follow the path to the next screen. We will find yourself at a strange bridge with three anvils. We've already passed that place. We've uh, we grabbed the three bottles and we passed the bridge. Once you reach the middle of the bridge, switch to the cursor, um, switch to the hand cursor and click on the lever. Now cross the, uh, the rest of the bridge to the other side and go to the next screen. This The next ki test is kinda hard and aggravating. It was, uh, <clears throat> or rather, um, it, it was um, definitely aggravating to me. So, read the paper again for more clues. So let's read the paper. What does it say? What does the paper say? The old map you obtained from the pirate captain is worn and fragile. It may very well be centuries old. All right. Now we're going to read actually read what it says. Begin you shall across the sea at okay. clear hue like the sky to find yourself on endless sand like blood and yet bone dry. Okay. And then to luscious fields of wheat, a wide expanse of crops, through waving grasses growing tall, and brushing across the Okay. Tops. High over snowy mountain pass, your journey is near the end. Step last onto the well-tilled earth, where wounded feet may mend. So first one is blue. Blue is the first stone. Number number two is... Uh, red. Red is number two. Three is, uh, I would assume the color of crops would be yellow. And then four would be, uh, waving, waving grasses growing tall and hand brushes across the crops. Green would be the fourth uh, stone. And, uh, High over snowy mountain pass, your journey is near the end. Five would be white. And finally, six. Step last over onto the well, trimmed hill earth where wounded feet may mend. I'm assuming brown. Alright, let's see what this says here. Let's see if this is correct. Alright. 
Let's see what this happens here. Okay, Let's see here. Let's get this controller working here. Alright. So grab all. Okay, so what you do, apparently, you have to step on the stones in a certain order. Or rather, in the or colors listed in the paper blue, okay, blue, red. Number two is red. Three is yellow. Green is four. White is five. And brown is the sixth. Oh, that's pretty straightforward. Let's just see what happens if I screw up, if I walk on the wrong one. The stone permeates purity. Okay. The stone emits a gentle blue light. Okay. Perhaps I walk on one. Ah! What happened? Ah! Uh, uh oh. Maybe the map should be color coded. Restore the game. Alright, we're back in it. So I've watched this video from a previous uh, YouTuber who did this before. I'll list his uh, channel on the on the YouTube video of mine, so you'll be able to subscribe to his channel as well. Special thanks to this guy, he really was very helpful, so let's see if we can do this. Blue, and red, then yellow, Yellow, then green to the right, and then blue, uh, then uh, white, white, then brown, and then blue again, blue, and then red again. Red again, then yellow, and then green, you. come on, green, you. green, then white, then brown, blue and then red red and yellow yellow then green, then white, then brown, and then off. We go! Woohoo! Save this as game. Save this game as, uh, we'll save this as, um, replace as color, uh, colored stones. Crossed. Success. Save. Replace. Excellent. Excellent. Woohoo! We did it, guys. We did it. We actually made it. All right. Where are we now? Here the path ends. Okay. Other than an unusual stone structure, there's nothing to suggest the presence of an abandoned stash. Perhaps the pirates were wrong. All right. Let's look at the, uh, what's the map say? What's in a name save for its sounds? They lie close by, look close around. For in creatures both small and great, the way is paved through Saren's gate. All right. We are going to take a break here, and we'll continue this adventure in another video. Save our game. Save our game. 
um, Replace, and we'll save this uh, game as um, <clears throat> uh, man. We'll place this as a uh, third trial. ordeal and we'll take a break here okay with game yes gamers like thank you for watching we play put King's Quest 3 to Era's human walkthrough uh, we just passed through the second ordeal on the pirate uh, treasure uh, treasure island and now we're on to the third ordeal coming soon to the next video. 